Home Instead Senior Care was set up in Nebraska in 1994 to help elderly people remain in their own home instead of entering a nursing home. The success of the business led to Irishman Ed Murphy bringing the franchise to Ireland. We set up Home Instead Senior Care in Ireland 11 years ago with a mission statement to enhance the lives of older people and their families. The service it provides is um, home care, including personal care, meal preparation, medication reminders, transport and light housekeeping. What we want to try and do is not just provide home care but, but really enhance their lives but because keeping them involved in the community, making sure that they don't end up in hospital because they're dehydrated or malnourished or not taking the right medication. So we make sure that happens. The important thing for Home and Stay is we match them up that they become a companion, they become a personal assistant and they become a friend of the family. Home Instead Senior Care is growing throughout the country and its latest office is opening here in the town of Castlebar. We opened our offices in March. Since then we've taken on 12 carers and there are three of us working in the office to support our carers in the community. The Home Instead experience throughout the country, this is the 22nd office of Home Instead in Ireland, would tell us that in the coming years we will be employing up to 100 caregivers and an office of up to 10 people in support of those caregivers. At the end of the day, senior citizens by far would prefer to be at home. Our seniors thrive at home, the familiarity of their own place. So where it is possible, and there are times that it is not possible, but where it is possible, we're delighted to be able to allow seniors and their families that opportunity to stay at home for a little bit longer than may have been possible. It's all about Mayo for us. We all realise we're so lucky to be at home, to be able to work at home, to be able to offer our services at home. So it's a particular privilege to have Antisha here with us this morning and both myself and all our carers and our staff were thrilled with this appearance. I think the franchise taken on here by Una Cox for Home Instead Senior Care is actually very important given that this is the third largest uh, county in the country. We've got a, a, a growing number of older people and because of the history of this county with emigration, many people live on their own and in isolation. Uh, but that's why I say that for uh, Home Instead Senior Care, they're all insured, they're all trained. Uh, so that the people who employ them will know that in looking after the family members they're getting somebody who's reliable, who's trustworthy, who will give uh, care and attention of a, of a caring nature, which is so important when dealing with, uh, with the health system and particularly with older people. It's not a job for everybody. You have to like people, you have to want to work with people and you know in, in many cases and in some cases in particular there can be great challenges and difficulties depending on the person that they're looking after. Now you will be aware that the government last week put an extra 500 million and half a billion into the health system. Much of that will be channeled towards primary care, community facilities, home care packages, mental health and so on. But all these things should be complementary and focused on the older person to give them both dignity, a quality of life and the respect that they deserve uh, from us as a country.